Good day everyone, I'm Philin Hero in front of a modern tropical house here in Avila, Taytay, Rizal. Once again, this is your dream home. Alright, so let's start our house here, but once again, please don't hit the subscribe button, hit the notification bell, and subscribe to our social media accounts, all the links will be in the description box below. And also check our listings, which is also in the description box. Alright, so this is the facade of your house, and as I have said earlier, this is a modern tropical house here in Avila, Taytay, Rizal. And in every modern, or in modern tropical houses, you have here uh, flat roofs, and also in your interior design, you have a nature endearing vibe, which is a common uh, design in every modern tropical houses. And as you can see, in your car gate, you have here timber screens, timber screens, which is a common shadowing techniques, no, or, or shadowing materials, no, that is seen in modern tropical houses. Yeah. So uh, let's start. So this is your car gate, which we lead you over to your two-car parking space. Yeah. And this is your pedestrian gate and yeah, so you have here your stairways which will lead you to your pedestrian gate with also um, outdoor lights no or step lights and yeah, so let's enter using your pedestrian gate all right so we are here on your two-car parking space with your uh, pvc ceiling design and yeah, so you have your pin lights installed to light this place up and also over here this is your storage space yeah so this is your storage space and also by the way as you can see you have your sun blasting design in your uh, walls yeah, and so let's proceed over to the covered porch area before entering using your main door over here all right so this is your courtyard and as you can see in your courtyard you have here a bench in which you can enjoy your uh, refreshing air in your subdivision and yeah, so very provincial vibe siya. and mamaya mas Makita pa natin yung nature endearing vibes sa loob ng bahay. Yan. And over here, you have here, I think, a 1 meter or 2, meter, two meter setback, which will lead you to the sliding door that will lead you to the kitchen area. Alright. So now, let's go back to the covered porch and enter using your main door. Yan. So this is your main door. And it is made of solid wood. So once again, welcome to your dream home. Alright, so now we are here inside the fair house. And this area can be your receiving area. Yeah, so sa tingin ko, um, para sa akin lang, hindi mo na kailang mas pagandain pa. Kasi as is, no, very natural and very refreshing na siya. So this is what I'm telling you earlier. So this is the nature and eating vibe that you have in the interior design of your house. But once again, it's up to you if you want to put a lot of things in this area. And yeah, so this is your receiving area in just a few steps. This is your uh, living area. So this is your living area, uh, dining area, and kitchen area. So this on an open layout uh, concept design. So in your living area, you have your sliding doors to allow for natural light for ventilation. So you have your outlets. No, this is where you can set up your TV table set, and this is where you can place your uh, sofa or L-shaped sofa. Yeah. So you have also here your light switches and installed with pin lights to light this place up. And just a few steps, this is your dining area. In your dining area, you can set up here six seaters dining table, so you have your provision for your hanging lights. And so, and your sliding door, you no, know, that uh, gives you a view of your subdivision, of your overlooking view here in this house. Yeah, and so this is your overlooking view that you have uh, from this house. Yeah, so all right, so now, uh, going back here, this is your dining area, and this is your kitchen area. So in your kitchen area, you have here your island countertop, which is quartz finish, you no, know, that uh, that is toned with um, white color cabinets. And so let's open the cabinets. All right, so this is uh, push to open, and all of them are soft close. And so you have here a sink, you have your uh, faucet. And this is your uh, pantry. Alright, so now, 
you have here once again your countertop, your cooktop, your range hood, and this is your service area. Your service area, this is where you can see your uh, breaker. And so you have your drainage, this is where you can do your laundry or um, heavy cleaning activities. And so you have your once again uh, sink, faucet, countertop, which is quartz finish. And underneath you have a space where you can put up your equipments. Alright, so once again you have a drainage over here. And yeah, so now let's go back on the main hallway and go to the first bedroom in this house. This is, so this is the first bedroom. And so this can be the room for the elderly or guest room or office room. So you have here outlets. Uh, provision for your aircon, split type or single type aircon. So you have here a space where you can set up your desk, no, or bed, single type bed or queen size type of bed. And this door will lead you to the service area. All right. So now let's proceed over to the common toilet and bath here on the ground floor and this is one of the unique doors that we have seen in our house tours and so this is the common toilet and bath here on the ground floor so this is your toilet your bidet and your tiles which is floor to ceiling your floating vanity design your sink faucet your vanity mirror and your shower space and so now let's proceed over to the second floor using your main stairs all right, so now we are here on the second floor of your house and this is where the bedrooms are located. And so over here, you have a view of your indoor garden. And so uh, it is natural for us to have a uh, liking no, sa nature. No? It gives a positive emotion, a positive impact sa emotion natin or mas nare-relax tayo. Yan. And also you have here your um, polycarbonated roofing to allow for natural light. And, and this is the second toilet and bath for this house. So you have here your shower space, and your tiles, which is floor to ceiling, your toilet, your bidet, and also your mirror with your floating vanity design, sink, and faucet. Alright, so now let's proceed over to the uh, second bedroom for this house. Right. So this is the second bedroom for this house. So you have your power outlets with pin lights and also your provision for your speed pipe aircon and you have here a door which is uh, for ventilation pero kung meron kayo mga batang kasama pwede kayo magpalagay ng fencing dito no or pwede kayo magpalagay ng hagdan for emergency exit and so safety first so this is so now let's proceed to the third bedroom so this is the third bedroom that we have in this house so you have here your power outlets and also over here, you, this is your cabinet. Yeah. yeah, so this is your cabinet for the second bedroom. All right. And you also have your speed type aircon, your desk, and this is your sliding windows for natural light and for ventilation. No? So pwede din siyang maging balcony. Kasi pwede kang lumabas dito sa part ng inyong bahay. And also, as you can see, meron siyang plant box. So pwede yung pagtaniman. Alright? So now, going back to the main hallway, let's proceed over to the third bedroom. To the uh, fourth bedroom. Yeah, so this is the fourth bedroom that we have in this house. So you have your power outlets once again. Same kind of flooring. Yeah, so you also have your sliding uh, window, sliding windows and your desk a provision for your split type aircon and cabinet yeah all right so now let's proceed over to the master's bedroom so this is the master's bedroom yeah so you can perfectly set up your king size or queen size type of bed so you have here uh, power outlets the provision for your split, split type aircon yeah? and over here you have here your uh, cabinets no so a lot of cabinets which also serves as parang uh, walk-in closet yeah 
And also, as you can see, you have provisions for your hanging lights. Now, let's proceed to the personal toilet and bath uh, for the master's bedroom. So, you have your bathtub, right, with your uh, huge wall niche and a gorgeous view of your overlooking view from your master's toilet and bathroom. So, your shower space, so you have here your tub, which is floor to ceiling your toilet, your bidet, your floating van design, and your vanity mirror. Right, so very gorgeous and parang ang sarap maligo sa bathroom na yan. So now, let's proceed to the balcony. Alright, so this is the balcony from this house. So you have here your um, flooring na hindi madulas, right? And this is your metal handrails. And your view from this house, your overlooking view. Alright, so now we are done touring this house. Let's now proceed for additional details. Alright, so for additional details of this house, so you have your lot area of 152 square meters and a floor area of 233 square meters. So overall, you have your five bedrooms with your toilet and bathroom and also your two-car parking space and your indoor garden. So this house has a total price of 19 million. If you think this house is for you, kindly contact us through this number to be shown below. Alright, so once again, I am Phil and this is your dream home.